Yes, it's your YouTube, and welcome back to the channel with some more set of course. Now, guys, if you've got um, Content Manager installed, and uh, you go into Settings and Custom Shaders Patch, and you go into New Mode, and you click on this, Overtake Mode, um, it's basically just the no hez eye like, score system for, like, overtaking cars and, like, cutting up cars and stuff. But... Um, you don't have to be in the server, uh, and you can just play it single player, and be able to play it on whatever map that you like, with, uh, traffic installed. Now, I'm going to show you a quick demonstration on the, uh, Shotoko Revival, and, uh, basically it's like, this, this sort of game mode's going to work on any map that you've got traffic set up on. Now, with the Shitoko, I need to make the traffic a lot denser. I've just not really had the time. I, I, I quickly tried to, like, increase the density of the traffic um, the other night. It didn't really work, so I'm going to have to do a bit more research on that. But if you can make, like, the three-lane traffic really dense, which is hopefully what I'm going to be able to bring you guys in the next video, is just how to set up the dense traffic. Um, just a little quick tutorial video on that. Just a really quick and simple one. But um, I think this is really fun because uh, with the no Hezai like servers and that, I, I'm i not a VIP member at the moment. Um, and I don't really know what sort of benefits that's going to give me that's going to be worthwhile me becoming a VIP member. So I really wanted to play like just the, basically like just cutting up through traffic and overtaking and stuff. But I actually have the score system. Now... It's incredible, it's actually in there guys, so if you've got um, custom shaders patch and you've got content manager and uh, you click on settings and just follow what I did at the beginning of the video and um, you'll get this. So it's like, I didn't even know this, maybe you all know this and it's all news but um, if you don't know it and you want to play Noezai without having to be in a Noezai poor quality server because they just re lag really, really bad. And it's like 90% of the time, it's literally just because of people jumping in and out that have either bad internet connections or like poor quality PC rigs. And it is, it's just causing lag in the server. So I think that looks really cool. And it's like, how fun is that, guys, to be able to play like the no hez eye, like weaving in and out of traffic and cutting up through traffic and that, yeah? With your actual scores just showing up on there without actually having to be online or in a server. And like, as well, it's the amount of bad drivers that are in the Nohezai lobbies and servers is just disgusting. So again, guys, um, if you're wanting to do the Nohezai style, like gameplay, if you want Nohezai game mode in single player, then this is it. And literally, it's as easy to set up as that, and it'll run on any map that you've got installed, whether it's a, a mod map or... Um, actually, um, I'm going to be putting a video together shortly on, um, like, the five best, like, open world slash mod maps to install for a set of Corsa. Um, Shitoko Revival is definitely on that list. Um, I'm going to look through and pick a couple more really really good ones that are really polished um, and that run really well um, and I'll put them in together in a video and I'll throw that up on the channel as well um, I'm going to be putting together in a set of course a car pack as well guys so once I've made that car pack I'll make the video for it and um, I'll throw it up on the discord um, I'll throw it up on the end of the video once the car pack's made and y'all can just download that and just installing cars and just enjoy them. Um, it's going to be a, a, a Honda car pack, so I'm just going to pick three Hondas. Um, the FD2, this one here that you see me driving. When the, I've got to do the suspension on this, so please ignore the terrible wheel driving in this. But I've not... It's good in a straight line, but in the suspension, other than being lowered at the rear, it's just not designed to handle this sort of pace around corners. So I'm, I'm going to fine-tune all the suspension before I release this car as a car mod for a set of Corsa. Um, and again, guys, this is the car that has the working laptop in it. 
I do have in mind the other two cars that I want to use for the Honda car pack for a set of Corsa. Um, but if there's any suggestions, please feel free to drop that in the comment section down below. Um, I want to say a big massive shout out and thank you to all the subscribers. Thank you guys for subscribing over the last few weeks and months. Um, your support, we appreciate it so much. So a big shout out to you guys. I want to say a big massive shout out to all the existing subscribers who have been here since dot day. Um, thank you guys for supporting the channel for all this time. Um, and hopefully all together we can grow this channel into something bigger and better in 2023. Um, don't forget to the bell notification icon to get notifications on all the new videos as soon as they hit the channel. Um, also, uh, I don't think I've had my mic turned up on this. So we'll see how poor this, this recording is, if I have to do it again or not. Let's hope it's it's. I've actually got the volume up on my mic. Otherwise, this is just gonna be a silent recording. I'll have to do it again. But if not, we'll be using this one. So, um, yeah. If you're enjoying the voiceovers, guys, and you're enjoying the content on the channel, um, drop it down in the comment section down below. Um, what your favourite set of Corsa car is that we've had on the channel so far. Um, we are going to be bringing you some GT7 and some Forza Horizon 5. Um, stay tuned for a Logitech um, 2023 wheel setting video for Set of Corsa. I'm going to do one for um, Forza Horizon 5 as well. And we'll, I haven't, do you know what? I haven't been back to GT7 for a while, but I use a resolution and the first one. Um, so I can use the Logitech G920 on PS4 for Gran Turismo 7. So I don't know if I can bring you any sort of settings on that, so I probably won't. But again, guys, um, please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section down below on what you think to this game mode. Like, I was looking and wanting something like this for single player. And just by chance, I actually found this. I didn't find anything referring to this on like Google or YouTube much. There's like one YouTube video regarding it, but it's got no information on it whatsoever in the description. And it's literally just a game mode being played. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I've enjoyed it. I thought it was something cool and really exciting that I haven't seen anybody mention, to be honest. And it's like, if you really don't want a bother wasting your time for the massive load into one of these open public no has i poor quality laggy servers because there's just so many people jumping in and jumping out and jumping in and jumping out um and you want to play that game mode on a set of course but in single player and be able to play it without having to worry about poor drivers in front of you displacing traffic that you as a good driver wouldn't have done and you end up crashing and losing your score and don't have to scroll through and try and find like some sort of other map run by some other discord channel that's not the Shotoko Revival project because just in case you guys are getting bored of the Shotoko Revival project any map that you've got installed guys that you can set traffic up on um, this game mode works on there and you can just play this game mode on there and I think this is so so cool so uh, thank you for watching the video thank you guys for stopping by and I think I'll just leave you with the rest of this video to be honest there's not much more of it to go I'm going to get on with making some more content um, I'm going to hit up GT7 because I'm real excited to see I haven't been back to it for months um, I'm going to jump back on Forza Horizon 5 as well Stay tuned for the, the new videos, uh, regular uploads. I'm going to try and upload video every every two days, if not every day from like now on. It just depends on if I can not be lazy, to be honest. And it's just like, I've fallen out of love with Forza Horizon 5. It, they just need to give us this drag DLC, and then I'll be like, yeah, Forza Horizon 5, sick again. And GT7... We need some more Hondas in there and some more JDM cars. So I hope after the, me not being back to it for a while that I've got some fresh JDM content. And if they've updated the used car section to be like it was more in like older Gran Turismo titles and especially like Gran Turismo 2 because like the used car section in Gran Turismo 2 was fire. 
and it just used to have so many different cars and it used to just update so many different times and that was just so cool. Um, Need for Speed Unbound as well. We will be going back to Need for Speed Unbound as well, guys. I want to just see what the game's like. I don't even know if it's had any updates or not. Because the reason I stopped playing that game, stopped putting videos up on that, is literally just because it was just poor, man. There were too many bugs and glitches for me to enjoy it. And the physics got to a point where it's like, yeah, they just weren't really that enjoyable anymore. So uh, let's hope all that's fixed. So again, guys, uh, smash the like button, smash the subscribe button. Feel free to leave a comment in the comment section down below. Don't forget to check out the Discord channel. The link's in the description down below as well. Um, if there's any suggestions on any videos that you guys want to see, drop that in the comment section down below. And if I can, I'll make that video and put it on the channel. Don't forget to hit the bell notification icon to get notifications on all the new videos as soon as they hit the channel. If there's any sponsors out there that want to sponsor me and um, give me a decent wheel cam um, and sponsor me, yeah. Happy racing. Stay safe. Peace. Tell me that you love me